Praise the Lord. We're excited about the Ministry International Institute Correspondence Program. And there's many, many people that love studying the Bible at home, getting into the Word of God at home, and reading powerful books at home that will transform your life. With me today, I have Dr. Chris Waller. He's the Vice President of Ministry International Institute. He also is the administrator. But you find yourself talking a lot to all these people that are calling in to correspond the Ministry or National Institute. Yes. And so what kind of people are calling you? Who who are these people? Well, typically they're going to be people who, uh, as you know, we do in-class programs where if you have the ability, you can sit in a class. But for those who don't have that ability, so, such as uh, maybe it's not in your, in, in your schedule, you may work a third shift job and, and classes are at night so you can't attend, or, or, or maybe you live in a city or state somewhere where we do not have a Bible college at this time that you can attend. But you can correspond our year one and year two program. Um, and it's gonna work just basically uh, as the same as, as sitting in a class. And this is our year one and this is our year two. Uh, and if you notice, it says our campus is the world. And we, we, we make that statement because our campus is around the world. Uh, but for the correspondent students, um, they have the ability to uh, work on their own level. In other words, they can work at their own pace uh, by doing it in their home. Yeah, some people are, are extremely busy. Yeah. And so they're able to uh, do like, well, I'm just going to take this course and it may take me a couple of months to get it done, but yeah. I can get it done. But some of them, they're like flying. I mean, they just like, oh, I've got all this time off and I'm going to apply myself and get through as much of this as we can. Oh, Lord, and, yeah. I've seen people go through the year one program in like seven months, and it's typically designed to go uh, 43 weeks. But, you know, sometimes if you have more time to put into it, of course, you can you can move at a faster pace. One of the things we found is that um, pastors like going through correspondence programs because a lot of them... Uh, either didn't get the education they needed before they started pastoring, maybe they mentored under somebody, mm -hmm. but they're wanting to go through Bible college, they're wanting that credibility in their life. And then the others are, maybe they've gone through some schooling and, and things like that, and, uh, and they're wanting to go further. Right. And uh, uh, one thing I really love about our courses, people are taking our courses because they really want to know the Word, and they really want to know God. Right. And uh, that's powerful. You know, a lot of the uh, different curriculums and things offer to study facts and history and, and theory and all the different things. Right. But ours takes them into a relationship with Jesus Christ. Well, you know, it says, and to know the truth and the truth will make you free. A lot of people wants to hear the truth. And I'm not against the theological courses or anything like that. But, you know, sometimes more than theory, I want to hear fact. Mm -hmm. And one thing that our program uh, gears people toward is fact. Mm -hmm. Fact of what the Word says, fact about who we are in Christ Jesus. And, mm -hmm. and so uh, this is what I like about our curriculum that, that, that God has inspired. It's like He inspired the Word of God. I believe that He inspired this curriculum too because it leads you to the Word. Well, even when you correspond from like after the associate program, we have the bachelor's through doctorate. Yes. And uh, now in that, it requires more reading. Our accreditation requires more reading yeah. uh, so that they can get the credit hours. And uh, But the books that were chosen uh, are very helpful yes. for you to be able to do the work of the ministry. You're going to learn the ins and outs of, of amazing people, amazing authors, people that have experienced God and had success and you're going to study their stories. You're going to study their revelations, and you're going to come into a strong place with God. Oh yeah, and when they get into the, uh, once they have completed the year one, year two associate program, the correspondent has the ability to move further. They can go into uh, our bachelor's program. Now, once you get into a bachelor's program, it is the books that you've just spoke of, and. Uh, uh, Basically, those books are, they, they do a question and answer for each chapter they read, and they do a 300-word essay at the end of each book explaining mm -hmm. what they've read. 
and, and that's how they're graded. And uh, all homework assignments, it's going to be simple, easy. All everyone that does homework from associate all the way through the doctorate, it's all done by email. I mean, we're in the in, in, in this technology world that we're in, and and through technology, I mean, everyone uses email. So we will correspond back and forth through email, and you can email me your homework assignments. I will grade them. I can email back your test, and and we just kind of go back and forth. Uh, through email, but it works beautifully and we keep up with your grades at the office. You know, um, as we're talking about this, there's many people that already have schooling from other areas and they've already got life experience. Some people have been in ministry for 10, 15, 20 years. Yeah. And uh, is there, what, what do we do about that? Is there anything we can do to help them? Uh, in that. But sure, uh, once once the student has completed year one and year two of our uh, associate program, we can actually review your college transcripts and and, uh, and, and, and use some of the hours that you earn through other colleges. Um, that is considered an upgrade. Uh, in some cases, if we need more hours, the student can could uh, use life experience. And life experience through our accreditation will allow you, as long as it's been consistent ministry, for every year that you've done ministry, up to 10 years, you get three credit hours per year. So if you have 10 years of life experience, that's going to be worth 30 credits. Oh, wow, a whole year. A whole year. And um, and so basically a student would, would want us to, to review. Now the results of that is a lot of times at graduation through the associate program, some of them may be graduating with a bachelor's. Yeah. And so there's all kinds of opportunity uh, using some of the some of the, the tools that you already have right in your arsenal. I mean, you know, uh, other, uh, other colleges, it could be a Bible college that you attended somewhere else, it could be uh, basically uh, even a, a secular college. You know, in the, in the secular college, you know, your basic courses, you've got English, math, English and math, and even psychology, and computer, and music, all that's used in ministry, so all it can it. be used as a part of our ministry course, so upgrades are, are, are... Exactly, but this is the reason why we have to have an opportunity to review your transcripts, is because by reviewing those transcripts, we can see how many credits and some of you may already be holding a bachelor's in, in some field, but you know we may not be able to use all those hours, but we can use some of those hours to apply to the ministry courses yeah. and results of that instead of an associate but, ministry or bachelor's. Now, there is a catch on this. And yeah. all, the accreditation firms always make you um, have to earn your bachelor, uh, your doctorate. Oh, yeah. And so, like, their upgrades will work all the way through master's, but then you got to earn your Yeah, doctorate. it doesn't matter how many credit hours that, that, that you've accumulated, even with, with, with our courses. What you have to understand is once you get to the master's level, that's it. Upgrades will only take you up to that point. From that point, then it's going to be required that you take the doctorate program where we have, once again, uh, books by different authors, great books, you have many books to choose from, yeah. and uh, each book will be worth so many credit hours, depending on the length of the book. Uh, but as they as they complete these books and we add up the credit hours, they have to have uh, 18 credit hours worth of books they read in the doctorate program, and then the 12 remaining credits are uh, would be their dissertation, which is a 150 page double space typed dissertation. Yeah. And uh, and so many students really enjoy doing that. It's, it could be lengthy at times doing the dissertation, but uh, it's a book. a book. They're writing a book. <laughs> yeah, it's a, what a way to start. You know what I mean? Okay, now you got your education, but now you got a book, and you know, however God uses you in your future, that's a powerful thing. I just think it's wonderful. You know, people prepare all their life for work here, but you know what? Many people never prepare for their eternity and I think that we need to know our God correspondence gives you a way to do that and it does and once again it's, it's the ability to be able to do this program uh, if you do not have the ability to sit in a class and uh, and, and it's worked powerfully I mean we have uh, quite a few people corresponding our courses right now and uh, and so if that is something that you're interested in you know I just had a sister down in Alabama and uh, she uh, emailed me and she says, well, I've sent everything in. I believe I'm finally getting my doctorate. Now, when <laughs> she started with us, she had nothing. This is six years of school to get her doctorate. And she, you could just tell she was just so happy. And, oh, and yeah. I know her. 
and and to get those emails like that or or uh, messages from people from all over the United States, you know, even other countries. Oh yeah, yeah. And, uh, it's so powerful. And so, Dr. Waller, it is a privilege having you here to talk about this with us, and uh, we just want right. to uh, honor you for what you do with Ministry International Institute, and then we want to tell the people it's time. All you got to do is pick up the phone and call us. You got to call. If you don't call, don't know what to do for you. Mm -hmm. But if you call, this could be the greatest step you've made in your life. Amen? Amen. And I love what it says on our textbooks. Our campus is, it is the, the world. world. Amen. <laughs> <laughs>